Good morning. Good afternoon. Today, yep, I found some. I found hoarders <laughs> on my little hobby farm. <laughs> I sure did. They don't seem to be sharing their toilet paper. Well, they may not use toilet paper. They don't seem to be sharing their food. As a matter of fact, they were dipping into my chicken feed. Uh, yeah, hoarders. A lot of bad stuff going on around the internet about hoarders. I'd like to set the record straight. <clears throat> you know, in one of the wisest books, and it's still the best seller in America, the Holy Bible. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> in the book of Proverbs, I read about ants. Yep, ants. They're very small species, but they're not stupid, they're wise. They go about their work and their business without anyone telling them what to do. They don't have a government to tell them what to do. FEMA told us to be ready for six weeks. That was a year ago. Surely you've had enough time to prepare. Uh, the ants are so small, they don't have an, an army. Although if you step into a bed of red ants, you're gonna think they're an army. <laughs> well, the ants, they just go about their business instinctively, doing what they do naturally. They gather in the spring and in the summer, they got their food. And then when it comes fall, late summer, early fall, they begin to store up their food for the winter because there won't be any food in the winter. They're pretty smart. I have to read this, I, I wrote it down. In uh, Proverbs six and eight, it says uh, the ants, it's talking about the ants, it said, they prepare their provisions in the summer they gather their food at harvest. What are you doing with your harvest? I don't know. I know what I do with my harvest. I put it in mason jars. <laughs> I put some of it in the freezer. So that if in the dead of winter, I want some tomatoes that I grew and canned, they're right there. I got them. Now in Proverbs, the sixth chapter, also on down towards verse 11, it says, go to the ant, you sluggard. Consider the ant's ways. How long will you lie around? In other words, how long are you gonna sit on that couch watching TV? How long are you gonna sit there in that chair playing Xbox? How long are you gonna sit in that chair complaining about me because I, I canned up my tomatoes? Oh, well. See, <clears throat> when are you going to wake up? That's what the Bible said. Proverbs chapter 6, verse 11, the end of it says, When will you wake up? Be like the ants. Gather your food at harvest. Store it up. Just like FEMA told us to do. It said be prepared for six weeks. You see, <clears throat> some of the people that are complaining about hoarders. They don't know anything about God's word. They don't care about God's word. They don't care about being self-sufficient. They're not very wise. They think that what comes on the television is what's true and honest. Yeah, okay. They don't have any regard for anything or anyone but their own ease, their own lifestyle, their cigarettes, their beer, their fingernails being done in the salon, the latest hairstyle, oh me, oh. a simple life is what is best. If you want to live and you want to live healthier, try a simple life. <laughs> you see, our government is a democratic government. I don't want to be like Venezuela. We gotta begin to think like ants.
think like the ants, consider their ways. Don't be foolish, but be wise and begin to store up your own food at harvest. If you can't, if you can't grow a garden, then go down to the farmer's market and buy it by the bushels. Bring it home and can it, put it in your freezer. If you can't do that, go to Aldi's or a discount grocery when they have it on sale and buy your groceries on sale. Hey, whatever you do, start being wise. Be like the ants. Thank you for listening.